Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Coach Bruce. You probably know me from a cup of mo, where I come and give you 60 seconds of motivation via my company called Cup of Mo LLC, where I'm a speaker and author of a book called Mama Said, 100 Life Guiding Quotes from a Wise Mother. But I'm not coming to talk to you about that today. Uh, I started an additional company that I still run today called the Riles Legacy Group. Uh, it's an insurance business that I started back in Philadelphia before I moved here to Atlanta. Uh, and I'd like to tell you my story on why I started that company and why I still run that company and provide excellent and professional services to my clients here in Atlanta, in uh, North Carolina, South Carolina, Mississippi, Alabama, uh, Pennsylvania. Well, the reason why is because years ago, my dad died at the age of 47. Dad had diabetes. Dad had a complication with diabetes and wouldn't stop drinking. And you and I both know that uh, drinking liquor uh, and having diabetes just don't go together. Um, this is definitely a death sentence. Well, when dad died, dad did not leave us a legacy of life insurance. Uh, there were bars that he managed and other people were able to buy those bars after his death. But if we had the money, we may have been able to capitalize on those bars, pay off debts or whatever. Uh, whether we wanted to run those bars or sell them, we would have basically had the opportunity of being business owners or being able to sell the property and make it something else. But dad didn't do that. So... Understand this, um, too many people in the Atlanta area, um, specifically in the Liberian community, uh, the men are dying without insurance. Um, I think it's a sad thing uh, because if you get life insurance while you're healthy, while you're young, uh, you can get it very inexpensively. Um, and even if you're sickly, we still can insure you because I have over 10 companies why I insure people from ages zero to age 90, no matter what health condition you are in. <laughs> so it leaves no excuse. So we as men should not be so selfish that we don't take care of our families in our absence. I'm very, very serious about that. Uh, you know, the Bible talks about if a man doesn't take care of his family, he's as bad as an infidel. You know, um, the Bible talks about in the, Proverbs 13 and 22, and this is the verse that my business stands on. It's the foundation of my business, and that is a good man leaves an inheritance to his children's children, and the wealth of the wicked is laid up for the righteous. You know, um, don't have time to go into the depths of that verse, but you probably get the gist of it. Now, usually when I'm talking to people about life insurance, I use a formula called DIME, D-I-M-E. Very simple formula, uh, and it's a formula that shows you how to calculate how much insurance you need. Now, debts, the D in DIME is for debts. If you have a debt on your car, if you have a debt uh, on your boat, whatever it is, um, you should be able to leave enough life insurance so that your husband or your wife can pay that debt off if your wife has a beauty salon, if your wife has a cleaning service, if your wife has a grocery store, whatever it is, you want to be able to pay that debt off so that you can continue to run that business or sell that business. At least you have the opportunity to have the authority to do either or. Now, the I in dime is for income. When you lose a spouse or you lose a husband, you lose their income as well. You see, life insurance is geared and is designed to protect against loss. It's a protection tool against loss. So that I is for income. So if a person says my income is $30,000 a year, I'm gonna need three, uh, three years or five years of my husband's income. So three times three is nine, you got $90,000 of insurance. If you have debts of say, say 50,000, uh, uh, 50000 plus 90000 that's 140000 of insurance. Now, we haven't even talked about the mortgage on the house. Now, the worst thing you can have is when you lose a husband or a spouse 
And when you lose their income, you also lose the house. It happens so often. Two ways people lose their house is a loss of spouse or sickness. Whereas cancer, whatever, now you're earning 60% of your income and now you can't afford to stay in the house. So you want to leave enough insurance to pay off the debts, replacement of income, pay off the house, and the ease for education. If you have children under the age of 18, they haven't gone to school yet, you want to be able to leave either some money or all the money to take care of their four years of college. Or even if they're going to a private school, be able to continue going to private school. Many kids are in public schools or in different schools where their mom and dads would not even uh, 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 suggest that they go there because a spouse passed away and you can't afford it. So ladies and gentlemen, these are the reasons why you need life insurance. Your debts, your income, your mortgage, your child's future. This is why it's called protection. Life insurance protection to protect against loss. Now, I want to speak specifically in the last 30 seconds to men. Men, we got to get it together. Take care of your family. Keep yourself healthy. Get life insurance so that when you are dead and gone, your wife and your children do not have to suffer. I don't bite my tongue. Get it together, men. And women, if you don't have life insurance, there's no excuse, okay? I want you to uh, send me an email at ryleslegacygroup at gmail.com. Again, that's ryleslegacygroup at gmail.com. If you're serious, you'll send me an email. I'll call you. We'll do an evaluation over the phone. It takes no more than about three minutes. We give you a couple of quotes, and then you can sleep nights knowing that you've protected yourself and you've taken care of your family. Have a good night. Thank you so much for listening. This is Coach Bruce at the Riles Legacy Group.